Everyone knows that Philadelphia has great restaurants, but how do you choose one? I'll show you what's exciting, what's unique, and what's happening right now in Philly's food scene. I'm Hope Cohen. Welcome to Crave Philly. You might know Village Whiskey in Rittenhouse Square for their burgers, but a little known fact is they cure all of their bacon in-house. And today we're gonna to be doing a bacon tasting with classic whiskey pairings. Typically, Village Whiskey cures their house bacon for seven days. I'm ready to meet with Chef Jonah, who's gonna show me how they do the house cure on the bacon. The curing process can differ depending on the type of bacon. It may be a wet or dry rub, and some types are smoked before curing. We got all the spices and ingredients in with the pork belly, and now comes the secret ingredient. George Dickel Rye. George Dickel Rye. The George Dickel single barrel whiskey is made from a mash bill of corn, rye, and malted barley. The most popular bacon is jalapeno, also available as a burger topping. They go through about three whole sides of pork belly per week for this bacon alone. They use Heritage Berkshire pork belly for all of the house bacons. Their bar will mix 50 Manhattans and Old Fashions on a busy day. Village Whiskey is known for their incredible burgers and they sell approximately 700 every week. So I just ordered the Village Whiskey Old Fashioned to pair with the Whiskey King Burger. That's a lobe of foie gras, blue cheese, rare burger, caramelized onions, and bacon. I cannot wait to taste this. I really needed some friends for all of this whiskey and bacon, so I recruited some guys to help me with the whiskey pairing and the bacon tasting. So we're down to our last piece of bacon. We all agreed that the pairing was incredible. Here's to the pairing of bacon and whiskey, another reason why you're gonna crave Philly.